haunting never-before-seen photographs of Titanic's launch go up for auction, incredible images found in a cupboard show doomed ship sliding into the water at a Belfast shipyard. Never seen before photographs showing the launch of the ill-fated Titanic from a shipyard in Belfast have been discovered in an old box in a cupboard 103 years later. The five black and white images show the world's biggest vessel sliding down a slipway and into the water for the first time in front of a massive crowd of 100,000 spectators. The snaps were taken at 12.15 p.m. on May 31, 1911, by a Belfast businessman who was given close access to the doomed liner inside the Harland and Wolfe shipyard. On the same day, the Titanic's sister ship, the RMS Olympic, that had been launched in October 1910, set off on her maiden trip to Liverpool which was to be her home port. After being launched, engineers spent months fitting Titanic's engines, funnels and superstructure before her sea trials began on April 2, 1912. The 45,000 ton liner set off from Southampton on April 10 on her maiden voyage to New York but struck an iceberg at 11.40 p.m. on April 14 and sunk less than three hours later at 2.20 a.m. on April 15 with the loss of 1,523 lives. The five glass plate positives that measure 4 INS by 4.5 ins are now being sold at auction in Wiltshire after being found by the family of the original photographer. The images show Titanic's massive hull and launch platform in great detail prior to launch and then during and after the ceremony. They are expected to sell for 8,000.